by means of the anointing a memorial was set up I said by means of the anointing a memorial was set up never to be forgotten more than 5,000 years later we are remember this is the second time today that I am reading this scripture bringing to memory what happened when Jacob arose and poured oil upon those stones that word oil is the word shemen he shamanized the stone and immortalized that stone that was there that is why it's more than 5,000 years we are still reading about that stone so shall your ministry and your ministry be that when it has been shamanized and the oil has come upon your ministry years and years will go by but it will be remembered it will have left a mark that can never be erased a mark that can never be removed something that cannot be taken away that's why when i look at people and i realize they are not after anointing i realize that they've not known what is the real thing that makes a difference that is why they just walk by the anointing they don't value the anointing they don't sow into the anointing they don't treasure the anointing rather they see clothes they see dresses they see cars they see houses you see a man of god you are looking at his car you see a man of god you are looking at his dressing you see a man of god you are looking at his wife you see a man of god you are counting how many times he has traveled you are looking at the wrong thing it is not any of those things that immortalizes your ministry i see an immortalization of your ministry that by your presence and by your ministry something unerasable unerasable there's a film called eraser eraser another film called terminator you see there are things in this world trying to terminate things trying to erase things trying to wipe out things but tonight by the power of the oil It will never be forgotten. In the realms of the spirit, it will stay forever. God will use you to do a permanent work. By power of the shaman. By power of the shaman. By power of the anointing. 